Hey Cardinal fans, welcome to this week's episode of Bird's Eye View. This weekly show will feature highlights from Cardinal Athletic and preview the week ahead. I'm Hannah Sickmiller, let's take a look at this week's action. The men's hockey team picked up their second straight sweep as they beat Cleary on both Friday and Saturday. Friday's game saw the Cardinals take the lead late in the third period on a goal from Thomas Hendry, while Saturday saw the Cardinals take an early 3-0 lead. Brandon Troyer picked up WAC Offensive Player of the Week honors this past week. The hockey team will have a home-and-home -home series with Indiana Tech this weekend. This past Saturday, the fifth-ranked football team fell to 11th-ranked Marion by a score of 25-7. The Cardinals will look to get back on track as they travel this week to Lawrence Tech. The women's soccer team went 1-1 one -on -one last week after picking up a win against Indiana Tech on Wednesday. Isabel Strawfish and Megan Starkey both picked up goals in the win. The Cardinals will close out their regular season with a home match against Lourdes and then travel to Aquinas on Saturday. The men's golf team competed last week at the LTU Heritage Hill Collegiate as they closed their fall schedule where Neil Heelan had a career for the Cardinals. Keelan's round of 73 on Tuesday tied him for top individual score in program history while his two-day score of 153 put him atop of the records. The golf team will be back in action in March when they return to the same tournament. The men's basketball team will open up their season as they will take on Great Lakes Christian tonight and follow up with Grace and Trinity International this weekend. Tip-off tonight is set for 7.30. The women's basketball team will also open up their season this week when they take on Spring Arbor on Thursday night and Indiana South Bend on Saturday. With both games at home, tip-off on Thursday is at 7. Also this week, the women's hockey team will travel to Missouri for a three-game trip. Men's soccer will close out their season with two road games. Volleyball will play two of their three matches at home. Esports will have one match this week and bowling will be at the American Heartland Classic. Stay up to date with all your Cardinal news scores and schedule updates at ConcordiaCardinals.com or follow us on social media at CUA Cardinals. Thanks again for tuning in and go Cards!